In this video, we introduce the Katonic ML Ops platform. Our ML Ops platform helps you build and deploy machine learning models into production quickly, securely, and cost effectively. Building the first proof of concept version of a machine learning system can be pretty easy. But when you try to operationalize, what was built as the prototype is only a small piece of what you need to pay attention to. Problems sh show up when you try to scale out and keep a system in long-term continuous operation. And no wonder in a recent survey, Gartner reported that more than 80% of data science projects don't succeed. According to a 2021 study from Algorithmia, the average deployment time for models that make it into production is 18 months. So why is AI hard? Well, let's dig in and find out. Often, when we talk about building a machine learning application, we're talking about developing the core model. Although it is at the heart of developing a machine learning application, but when you are building, deploying, and running a machine learning application in production, it entails many other stages. To bring them into production, datasets must first be captured, stored, cleaned, and curated to extract insights and train ML models. Once trained, models need to be deployed in scalable and secure production environments. The models need to be monitored and retrained with new data to improve them. Only a small fraction of real-world ML systems are composed of the ML code, as shown by the small box in the middle. The required surrounding infrastructure is vast and complex. So the first challenge is, AI is not limited to model training. Software is deterministic or repeatable since it produces the very same output when given the same input no matter how many times it is run. Whereas in AI the outcome of training a model can change significantly based on the changes in the underlying data. As a result, models have to be continually monitored to detect performance degradation and model staleness and will need to be retrained and remodeled often. These factors make it painfully clear that AI is hard because it depends neither on code nor on data alone but on the combination of both. Since AI depends on a combination of code and data, many different people need to get involved to train a machine learning model and deploy it in production. Usually, a combination of software engineers, data scientists, and data engineers are involved. So getting all of these people involved and coordinating among them is a major challenge. Organizations have low collaboration between ML development and operations. AI is hard because AI requires many different roles to get involved. It becomes harder because each of these people uses different sets of tools. In software development usually, a team standardizes on a stack, like which language, code versioning or CI-CD system to use. In AI, different individuals prefer different machine learning frameworks, use different IDE and most certainly don't follow common CI-CD practices. Here is a data and AI landscape from Matt Turk. If you are a data scientist or a researcher, you look at this landscape and you get excited with the thriving ecosystem of innovation with lots of opportunities for investments and PhD thesis. However, if you're an enterprise architect responsible for making purchasing decisions or a tech lead, you probably think that this is a procurement and DevOps nightmare. You'll have to look at each one of these boxes and pick the right tool and then spend lots of time and energy stitching them together. So the tooling is really hard because AI requires integrating many different components. And to add to the problem this space is moving at a breakneck pace. To solve these challenges of AI, the practice of ML Ops has been introduced in the last two or three years into the industry. ML Ops is about unifying both of them, the development part by the data scientist and the operations part of the machine learning engineers. MLOps is not as simple as bringing the DevOps practice into the machine learning system. DevOps solves the problem of the right side like scalability, availability, etc. But in the case of ML systems, there are unique challenges specific to machine learning such as data, features, pipeline governance along with continuous training and continuous monitoring. Introducing the Katonic ML Ops Platform It is a platform for customers and developers to introduce the same ML Ops practice into their production systems. Katonic ML Ops Platform is a collaborative platform with a unified UI to manage all your data science in one place. The platform combines the creative scientific process of data scientists with the professional software engineering process to build and deploy machine learning models into production safely, quickly, and in a sustainable way. 
This is a shared platform for ML systems and development, where multiple stakeholders like data scientists build experiments and develop models. Ops engineers and ML engineers use the same platform to look at what's going on inside the machine learning and deployment pipeline and the serving infrastructure. Other stakeholders, like the product managers, would use the platform to get complete visibility with real-time insights and alerts on model performance to see how the machine learning model is working against the business objectives. MLOps not only gives organizations a competitive edge but also allows companies to implement more machine learning use cases, which results in various business benefits. MLOps help you get seven times more cost-effective infrastructure by managing and controlling costs by running data science workloads more efficiently, reducing compute costs, 12 times faster deployments of models in production, 85% reduction in manual labor costs through higher productivity of the data science team. You can give Katonic a spin by signing up to the Katonic ML Ops platform hosted by us free for 14 days. The free trial is an ideal way for data scientists and other practitioners to get an understanding of how an enterprise ML Ops platform can make their day-to-day -day work easier and more efficient. You can also download a community version of the platform, which can be installed in your private AWS, GCP, or Azure account. For more information, please visit www.katonic.ai.